What this is here, this is all about metal. <laughs> That's what this is. But I'm not kidding. <laughs> metal. that works with Fat is they're just good people and it's rare that bands want to leave the label. Where will it be 25 years from now? I think it's probably going to still be going on. You know, Mike and Aaron set up such a cool thing and all the bands are super stoked to be there and uh, they're always signing new artists so I think it's going to be something cool that go on for a long time and hopefully outlive all of us. Will we even be around after this tour? Our livers will all give out by the end of this tour with the lineup. So, but I mean, I hope, I hope they, you know, pass the reins and it continues on and, and developing and getting bands. And I hope that thing keeps flourishing. You know, it'd be nice to keep a scene together. We signed the fat without having met him, I think, which is kind of cool. Yeah, that is cool. Because our demo was so good. <laughs> and uh, no, it's like the guys from Against Me and Lawrence Arms like talked talk him into signing us and then we went on tour in Europe with the Gimmies and that's when we met him. And I remember the, the first time we met him, we got into the backstage area and we were all smoking cigarettes. And we got in and he said, oh, no smoking. So we just... <laughs> First day. Yeah. First like, time we met him, we I think we made a mistake. Aaron and I just met her when we... Uh, that's actually a pretty cool story. Uh, when my girlfriend turned 30 years old, I wanted to go to San Francisco. And I asked Fat Mike and he actually lent me a house for two weeks. So I went there with my girlfriend and Aaron invited me for uh, dinner. Mike was on tour. I went there for, uh, for uh, supper and she... Um, bought way too many sushis for four people. Like she bought like, we do four, that, like for like 25. We do that like once a week.